longer just a concept. Manufacturers are throwing money into developing electric and hybrid cars. We have invested in hybrid as well as purely electric cars. The commercialization has just started. We sell three to four thousand of them a year now. Most domestic producers are at the initial stage. The potential is big. But that potential is still limited by technology and supporting facilities. I think cruise distance is very important, as well as whether it is convenient to recharge, and safety is also a concern for me. This car has two engines, one is using battery. Fully charged, it can drive for 70 kilometers. Mr. Cao's company supplies parts for this hybrid car. I think hybrid cars are a more practical choice because pure electric cars are too expensive. This car sells for 300,000 yuan, even with a subsidy. It is still too expensive for most buyers. Last year, the government issued plans to promote green energy cars. Now, severe air pollution is prompting many local authorities to start putting less polluting vehicles into the public transport system. Many believe electric cars may represent the future of auto industry. It may still too early to be sure as there are many obstacles lay on the road ahead. But whoever sees the opportunity may change the auto industry forever. Ning Hong, CCTV, Guangzhou.